Hopefully raining outside today. It's April 30th. The kids are still asleep. It's about 6.30. Got my coffee and for some reason the power's out. I usually sit over there and do my quiet time. The power went out today. What's for breakfast? Cereal and yogurt? No. This Nintendo still works. You know the power is still out. So is he still sleeping? This kid man in his robe. <laughs> I see you. I see you. Get the lights are on. This is what your fourth breakfast? Oh my goodness. Good morning, Ami Jewel. They yeah. are. Yep. Good I job. Help. I helped her. You helped her get her shoes on? Thank yeah. you. No, I didn't help her get her shoes on. Um, I just helped her doing the right foot. Oh, good job, Sissy. Yeah. All right, let's get this boy oh, off to oh, school. I had no water today. Well, drink some water. Yep, let's drop him off. My mommy's going to go work out. Okay, so it's Tuesday here. I think last time we filmed on Tuesday. And I want to do a different day, but today is different because my girls have a staff like in service day, so they don't have school. So we just took back them to school, and I really wanted to fit a workout in, so I'm gonna have a babysitter come for like an hour and a half so I can run to Orange Theory. That's why I have dirty hair and like crazy makeup. Just wanted to get real with you for a second. I did it, I stepped on the scale this morning, and when I do that because sometimes it makes me happy and sometimes it totally makes me want to cry. Today's one of those days where it makes me want to cry and I want to let it ruin my day. I want to just go down a deep dark rabbit hole of all the things that I know you can relate to as a woman. Um, but you know what? I am choosing to A. I know, well, I know in my heart that the scale does not define who I am, that it, it is just a number. Um, however, I feel defeated a little bit because I've been trying to work on getting down to a certain number. I'm just like, I have this sweet spot where I feel like my best and I wanna get there. But I also love life and I love good food and wine and pizza and all the things that you as well I'm sure enjoy so I have this really hard time finding balance and I want to be real with you because I feel like you probably can relate maybe not but um, when I do whole 30 I feel amazing I feel great but that's not realistic like living a whole 30 lifestyle is also really hard and challenging in its own ways and it's not fun like I can do that and commit to it, but when I'm not on a certain program, I have like a hard time just finding balance and then being at that sweet spot where I just feel great. And anyways, long story short, I want to be vulnerable with you. I wanted to be open with you. I wanted to say, I get it. I struggle too. I'm like probably 90% of you that are watching this. Um, just constantly, it's a battle. It's a battle of the mind. It's the battle of the willpower. Um, and I am really passionate about women embracing who God created them to be. Like so passionate down to my core that um, I want to see us all be set free free from this. I want to see freedom in this area. And so, but with that comes struggle. And so I also wanted to be vulnerable with you and share that that also is just a weak spot of mine. That's something that I'm just still grinding on and just praying through and just really um, working hard to be set free from that, to not be defined by a number, to not be so tied to a diet, to live just how I want to live. Um, but it's a balance, right? Like I can't just eat pizza every day. So um, yeah. So that's where I'm at. I was this close to being like, okay, I started the vlog today, but now I'm gonna not do that. But you know what? This is day in the life. This is Ashlyn. And I feel like you guys need to see that too. So with that said, my babysitter's coming. I'm gonna go work out and I'm gonna just run my little tushy off at Orange Theory and be grateful that God has given me the ability to run, grateful that I have this body, grateful that God has made me just strong. And um, yeah, 
I'm gonna just go into today with gratitude instead of the negative self-talk. So let's do this. <laughs> Guess who's going to Orange Theory with me? Pick this guy up. Hey everybody. 9 a.m. <laughs> have brushed my teeth. I'm doing construction all morning. <laughs> oh, so fun though. Spontaneous date. Let's go. So we got a new little rental house. Today's the last day for us to fix it up before our renters move in tomorrow. Just got done with the workout. <laughs> we just dropped Trav off so he can do a couple little things. It's not a typical Tuesday. He's usually at work. Please. I thought you wanted the little cup ones. Can I have There's some tea? freak in our Orange Theory who was beating me by seconds on the Mom, rower, man. Tea? What a goofball. What'd you get, Trev? 26.6. Three hundredths behind the number first guy. Mommy, let's, let's congratulate number one. <laughs> Mr. Competitive. Guilty. Love <laughs> uh, the camera, huh? Someone's on a camera tire. How's the lunch? Good. What's on your agenda the rest of the couple hours for baseball? <laughs> have free lunch and do a shower. Nice. Make some money. Great. If you watch my favorite things video, these are the best. I'm gonna do a little sandwich roll up in this. Ashlyn always makes herself the more <laughs> high end professional lunch. <laughs> Hey, that's the lunch exactly like you like. Me. It's like the yeah, it's like two dollars at Vons. It's like a hundred slices. No, I love following you guys on Instagram, and one of you, the Cozy Craftsman, posted this quinoa salad. So kale in here with a little bit of olive oil and lemon juice, and it's kind of been sitting. I put a little bit of sea salt. I had a little bit of leftover quinoa from the other night, about a cup. I mixed in some dill and also some artichoke hearts. So I'm gonna just dump that in here. And then I have some chopped up raw almonds. I'm gonna put those in. Good stir. This looks delicious. When I saw her make it on Instagram the other night, I was like, oh, I want to make that. It looks so good. And I'm starving after our workout. Our series is really intense. I burned like. 630 calories today, so starving. So that looks good. I'm gonna eat it with a side of the Siete tortilla. And there's my lunch. That looks delicious. Well, that was delicious. Very filling, very satisfying. Always a good reminder to take a little bit of extra time to prepare a good meal. So you don't want to eat an entire bag of junk food. I did have just a couple, but that was it. Working on balance, right? <laughs> I mean, come on. Who's reading to who? It's just making the page. It's ripped. It's ripped. Oh, don't rip it. Just be gentle with it. You girls are cute. I'm gonna get in the shower really quick and then we're gonna take a nap, okay? Yeah. Okay. We gotta also well, clean up. Okay, girls are napping and I wanted to show you on my favorite things video I was telling you about I impact mascara is like my favorite in black. So this is without these are my lashes using lash boost they're getting super long and that's them without mascara and this is them with just like a couple coats of mascara no primer or anything and then i was telling you guys about that cabrow stuff so this is the brow with i should have done all one side and all one not this is the brow with cabrow and then the glossier boy brow over it this is the difference doesn't i mean it looks really drastic with just one done but I am obsessed. I feel like it makes the biggest difference. So I'll show you how I do that really quick. Brow stuff and you just take it off. This is the travel size. It has this little brush and you just dip it into this little gel stuff. 
like so. Just kind of do little strokes like so. Fill in where it needs to be filled in. Kind of lengthen it a little bit. So then it has sometimes like a little bit of stuff, which is like why I like to take the Glossier Boy Brow with that wand. And then I, let me look in the mirror here. Just kind of go over it. It kind of breaks up everything, makes it a little more natural looking. And it does have a little bit of pigmentation. I have the blonde one. And you can kind of shape them and fluff them, fluff them out as needed. But some do the other eye and that's just like a simple quick makeup. We have a baseball game later. I'm usually ready way earlier. It's like 1 p.m. My girls are down for a nap. Finish my eyes. Now they're equal. And yeah, so I have to leave to go get Beckham at 3.30. Gets it at 3.35. My sister just had her baby. She didn't know what she was having. All three of my sisters had babies in the last few months. Two of them were boys, and then my sister Leah just had a surprise baby girl. And so they named her Coral Milan, and I just ordered this online for her. I love these little jelly cat stuffed animals. They're so soft, and I thought this unicorn was cute. <laughs> Today is a rare occasion for you. Hey, what are you doing? Come with your brothers. Three o'clock, and I finally dressed for the day. I had to bust out this winter sweater that I kind of packed away. And I'm wearing this J. Crew top, Abercrombie and Fitch jeggings, and my new Steve Madden platform tennis. Oh, I got that for baby coral. Do you love it? Yeah. Isn't it so cute and cozy? Yeah. What is it? What kind of animal? It's a unicorn. Yeah. So cute. You think she's going to love it? Yeah. Oh. So Who doesn't love it? That, this is for baby coral. Yeah. What's her name? And she's a unicorn. What's your new baby cousin's our, name? No, it's, it's baby corals. Coral. <laughs> Coral. That's our? Coral. Coral. <laughs> Okay, putting this chicken in to marinate so we can grill it up tonight. Off to get brother. Okay, back. How many home runs have you got? Four. And are you gonna get another one tonight? This guy's home run master this season. Pretty epic. dinner. I'm just going to heat some of this leftover pizza for a little side dish for the kiddos with their chicken. Made that kale salad. Classy <laughs> Tuesday night dinner. Coming at ya. So I made it again tonight. The quinoa, the artichoke hearts. I added a little bit of Parmesan cheese instead of the instead of the pecans tonight since we're gonna also have grilled chicken and that is about it I'm going to finish dinner serve it to the fam and sign off because I got to get these kids bathed into bed so love you guys thanks for watching another day in the life with the Carter family I will see you guys next month hope today was semi-interesting take care bye everyone